Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Hannah here. Thank you so much for joining me today. So, first of all, we have this mood lighting going on because it is currently, one second, let me just get rid of my text messages, 8.31 in the morning, so we don't have much sunlight. However, I've just sent Noah to nursery and I've got two hours free until I go and meet a friend. So I thought I'll film my videos, I'll film these Shein hauls for you and kind of show you what I've got. I will do the try-ons at a separate time just because this lighting is not good enough for try-ons. You won't really be able to see the clothing. But for like the main portion of the video, it's okay. Now I'll continue my try-ons. So what I'll do is I'll just pop this a little bit to the side so I can put all my try-ons in this corner right here. Um, you can see all the mess in my bedroom. It is what it is. Um, what I've got for you today is a Valentine's Day try-on. Now, girl, this is a realistic Valentine's Day try-on. Um, I am showing you realistically what I would wear to Valentine's Day this year. Now, unfortunately for me, Valentine's Day is falling on the day I'm going back to work. So, Monday the 14th of February, I am actually going back to work after a year off or just less than a year off for maternity leave. And um, this is my realistic, what I would wear to work on Valentine's Day or what I would wear on Valentine's Day in general. So you've not got kind of all the body cons and sexy clothing and stuff, because first of all, that's not me, you know that already. And secondly, um, for me, anything like red or pink is like considered Valentine's Day, do you know what I mean? Or anything that's like sleek or anything like that. So I thought I'd share with you what I got I'll link everything in the description below for you. So if you want anything, then go check it out. Don't forget you can use my code HANAHARTS15 for 15% off. And I think there might be a Valentine's Day code as well. I'll leave that on the screen right now and also in the description below. Um, so I have tried these on. I'm going to start with the first piece. But before I do, can I please ask that you like my video just so that people on YouTube can discover my Shein haul and my channel and we can grow the family here on Hannah Hart's um, channel. So um, yeah, so please, please, please give me a thumbs up and leave a comment what your favorite piece is below um, and tell me whether or not you would realistically wear these Valentine's Day outfits or are you more of a dressy up Valentine's Day girl? We don't really celebrate Valentine's. So I'll show you my first outfit, which is inside out of course because i've tried everything on so it's inside out but it's this gorgeous wine red cranberry whatever you want to call it pleated top now i have this in light brown and um, light pink sorry and i have it in black as well i got it in a 4xl instead of a 3xl just because i like the look of it being oversized and then wearing some like tight pants with it so this is what it looks like. It's like a pleated, gorgeous, wine-coloured shirt. It's very oversized. And then it has this gorgeous lettuce trim at the bottom as well. So it's like a gorgeous little ruffle at the bottom of the um, shirt and also at the end of the sleeves. It kind of crunches up nicely. Um, so like I said, I got this in a 4XL. Excuse me, my nose is so itchy. I uh, got it in a 4XL. It's nice and buggy and I would probably just wear this with like some leather leggings maybe and like a pointed shoe or something. Um, and this is realistically what I would wear on Valentine's Day because it's like a red maroony Valentine's-y colour but it's still casual enough for work, you know, because I'm going to work on Valentine's Day. So um, this was my first item. The second item I want to show you is like a bougie Valentine's in terms of you're going to work on Valentine's Day and you want to make sure that they know it's Valentine's Day, but also that you're a bad boss. Do you know what I mean? Like you're a badass boss. So it's a suit. It's a nude, kind of like a really light, light pink nude um, suit. Got it in a size 4XL again, just because of the pants. And I am going to get the pants tailored because I do like them, but they're a bit wide at the bottom. So these are the pants. Now you may have seen this on other people's channels in like a bright pink color. For me, bright pink isn't going to cut it. I mean, especially for work, I'm not going to go in in a bright pink suit. Who do I think I am? So, but I would go in this like light dusty pink suit, which also has like a brown, it's like a brown color. I think it's brown. Am I a bit colorblind? A brown check um, on it. So you can see they are supposed to be tailored pants, but because they're a 4XL, they're a little bit wide at the bottom. But in terms of the pouch and stuff, the pooch, they do cover it pretty darn well. So those are the pants. And then the blazer is gorgeous as well. I've seen this on so many YouTube channels. It has uh, little shoulder pads, but no lining, unfortunately, which makes it feel a little bit cheap. Um, no lining. And it is a double-breasted blazer. 
it does have pockets but i think they're fake are they oh they might be real actually let's have a look no i think they're fake oh no they're real pockets look at that they are actually real so i think you just have to undo the stitching on the actual pocket itself um and then you've got pockets as well on your blazer and i I'd probably wear this with a brown satin um cami for night with a heel but for the day for work i would just wear like a white t-shirt or something like that or like a white ribbed crop top or something and obviously the crop top would be tucked into the pants because the pants are very high waisted because i don't show my stomach so uh so that's what i would wear like if i was i don't know i probably i probably wouldn't wear that for valentine's day like actual 14th of february vibes because i feel like first day back at work going in in a suit who do i think i am but if i'd been at work a while already and then it came to valentine's day then i would wear that you know i don't want to go back to work on the first day in a suit uh then this one is a little bit less work wary um it's very i want to say mumsy it is very mumsy it's very covered very modest so um it's basically this let me show you it's like a maxi dress that's gold foil on pink which is really cute and i would probably wear this just for like a cute dinner maybe if i was on holiday you know i wouldn't wear it here because it's too cold to wear like a maxi dress um, but this is what it looks like it's got a high neck i got this in a 3xl as you can see um it's got a high neck a little kind of peephole at the top which doesn't really show anything this the sleeves are not lined the rest of the dress is and they've got a cuff at the end of it and then it's literally straight up and down and has one tier at the bottom but it comes with a little belt now i probably wouldn't use this belt i'd use my own belt just to kind of break up the pattern a little bit but if you wanted to you could use the belt that it came with as well sorry i've got like hangnail is that gross the lighting is so bad i'm so sorry i feel like i look so dark like everything's shadowed you know uh but yeah so i love the fact that this shines and shimmers and i would wear it with my own belt maybe crop it a little bit in terms of like pulling it up and tucking it underneath the belt a little bit but you could wear it on its own if you were in a warm country like if i was in turkey or something and it's now january i would be wearing this type of um a dress and i probably will take that dress on holiday with me because it is a really really cute piece then we have what is this oh this is like a little bit of a dressier up piece now girl i would never ever pick something like this but i thought it's valentine's day i need to do it for the viewers you know and this is the reason that i asked you to comment as well because if you say to me oh i love this style on you hannah then i'd be like oh okay then they like this particular piece i'm gonna buy more of that so i can show you more of those particular pieces but this is let me see is it inside out first of all no it's not so this is a maroon dress it has little like flute i want to call it flute sleeves like they're just like flute outwards you know and then it has an elasticated waist but it has a gorgeous hanky hem now i hate hanky hems hanky hem hem lines i feel like they make everything hanky hem for plus size people and we just don't like hanky hems especially when they're on tank tops or on like um tunic tops to make hanky hems but on a dress i don't mind it um and i thought that this would look really nice if you wore like a pearl belt or like a silver um diamante belt with it um it's got like a hanky hem as i said you'll be able to see better in the try on but it is really really long and it is more valentine's day style like it is very floaty very flirty and if you wear it with like a little bit of diamantes then it'll really dress it up especially for the evening time so for that one i did pick out something that is valentine's -y and i would wear out to dinner as well even though like so i'm going to work on that offensive which is it's not on sis um and then oh i have such a big bag of sheen stuff let me show you this this bloody bag and this was full to the top so then i have um this which is gorgeous uh very very valentine's day s because it's a bright bubblegum pink um but still very me because it is lined and piped with not lined and piped what am i saying it's lined on the inside and then it's piped with this black um it has shoulder pads which i don't really like but it's fine and it has these gorgeous little chanel -y black buttons and this can you imagine with like a roll neck and like a pair of trousers or if you swear with leggings whatever a roll neck and then this on top it's so nice it is very valentine's -y because of the color itself and this camera is not doing it justice at all like let me see if i can put my flash on or something does that help probably not probably not um 
I'm really hungry, guys. I'm so hungry. This. My husband's left a mini eggs bar here. Mmm, smells so good. Um, so yeah, this is so nice. It does have functional pockets as well. I like this. I would wear this on a day to day. I'd wear it for Valentine's Day for work. Um, but I would also wear it on a day to day, like I said, with like a roll neck black top, black leggings, and a cute Chanel esque cat toe shoe. Because we love to be bougie, even though we can't afford anything. Right. Um, <laughs> next, I have the same top that you saw on the first try on but in a lilac colour. This is so perfect for spring. Oh my God, this camera's not doing anything justice. It's lilac and you can't even tell. I'm gonna make sure that I do the try on when it's nice and light and bright. So I'll probably do it next week when Noah goes to nursery on like a Monday afternoon. I'm gonna do the try on and I'm gonna make sure the lighting is amazing so that you can see all the pieces really, really well because you can't actually see the pieces too well right now, right here which is super, super annoying. But this is a gorgeous, gorgeous lilac piece. Um, again, it's in a size 4XL. It's very floaty, very flirty. Has a lettuce trim hem on the actual bottom of the shirt and also at the bottom of the sleeves. This with white trousers in the springtime with like a rope sandal is gonna be beautiful. It's gonna look so, so nice with light trousers. I really need to find like a white jean or a white trouser because that would just look gorgeous. Imagine with like a white trouser that has a split up the front. Beautiful, insane, gorgeous. So um, that's the lilac one. Then I have this dress, which is a little bit of a dud for me, if I'm honest with you. Like for this, I'm not a big fan because it's so deep in the V. And what I mean by that is like the neckline is so deep. Uh, everything is hanging out. So I would have to like maybe pass this on or something because the neckline is just too deep for me, too cleavagey for me. It is very Valentine's because there's this gorgeous rose pattern on it. The flowers are beautiful. The print is beautiful. I love, love, love the pattern. Look how Valentine's that is. It's so beautiful, but it's just too deep in the V. Like I've got some um, high neck ribbed black little crop toppy type things what is that in the background oh okay um some crop toppy type things but if i put that underneath it's gonna make it look like a winter dress and it's not a winter dress it's a valentine's day dress i mean i suppose you could do that but then it wouldn't be very valentine's because it'd be too modest for valentine's day i mean who cares but this is the dress it's long sleeved it's got a little cuff and a little kind of like um what is this like an elasticated cuff it's just too ugh like down it's like down there and i don't want to be showing off the girls to everybody it's valentine's day i need to save that for my husband you know so if this is your vibe then definitely go for it because it's a gorgeous print but for me unfortunately it's not worked out and i got that in a size 3xl so the majority of things are in 3xl because i'm a size 20 22 ish Ooh. 20 to 22 and a size 3xl is a size 22 so i just go with a 22 just to be on the safe side oh i love this dress this is not valentine's -y. this is like morticia adams but i just couldn't resist this dress i love it let me show you it's so plain so simple i've just put it on it i've just put it inside out i was supposed to put it right side in you know what i mean but i've just put it inside out by accident right let me show you this dress so this is the dress, it's a size 3XL. It's got two little buttons, a nice little white collar, long sleeves, totally Morticia Adams. But I love it, I love it. Just this, look at how cute this is. It's absolutely plain black, guys. It's a fit and flare type dress. My husband really, really likes the shape of this. I would probably wear this with a belt. If I didn't wear it with a belt, I'd wear it with like a skinny black belt because I don't want something to break up this, um, the way that this is but i want something to cinch me in a little bit more you know so i wear it with like a skinny black belt or something or a thick black belt but this is so cute can you imagine this and then like a chanel-esque tweed little jacket on top it'd be so cute i love this i think this is so nice probably not very valentine's -y, but it's so cute i really really like this one um obviously if it was valentine's -y at work then i would definitely wear it which mine is valentine's at work um, and then what do I have? Okay, I have this, which again is a little bit more like saucy. Um, depending on how you wear it, I probably wear it off the shoulder because it's too torn. Let me show you. So it's a satin shirt, similar to what I'm wearing today, 
but it's two-tone it's um black on one side and like cream on the other side this was super cheap as well i think it's about eight pounds or something um but this is what it looks like and i feel like if you wore this with like a tank top underneath to hide the brass bra strap and then you had this off the shoulder because it's two-tone it would look really really cute and quite sexy as well um but also still very modest and then i'd wear like a strappy heel with it or something i will try and um like i said i will really really try and style these pieces when i do the try on for you just because i feel like i don't have time to style the pieces when i'm filming videos or when i'm filming the try on because i'm usually doing it while noah is asleep but now that he's at nursery and i've still got like two weeks left for maternity i will try my best to put some effort into these videos or a little bit more effort into these videos you know and then this is a dud unfortunately so let me show you this item right here it is a dud why because um because it's been cut very weird so it's just a plain black top but can you see the neckline is really really wide so when i put it on it kind of like goes in a weird shape and i don't know if it's the way that it's been sewn or something but it's been sewn very weird i don't know how to explain it i'll try and show you in the try on so i wouldn't recommend this so i'm not even going to show you it properly because i'm not going to show you things that I'm not going to show you things properly as in like, oh, look at this item because if it's crap, it's crap at the end of the day. And that one is crap. I wouldn't recommend buying that one. So for that one, we'll insert a tiny little short try on clip, but don't buy that item. And then we have this, which is in a size 3XL and it's so nice. It's like a pirate-esque top. This, super sexy with leather leggings. Um, it's got a sheared waist and it peplums out. It's just a white shirt. So if you're a white shirt type of girl, I'd wear this with even vinyl, like leather, um, vinyl leather, what I was saying, like, you know, vinyl leggings, those really, really super shiny ones. I'd wear that with this because it's so plain and like lots of gold, jewelry, gold chains look like proper pirate like um and then like um a nice strappy sandal or something i think that would be really really cool depending on your style but i do recommend this it fits gorgeous as well it's in a size 3xl it does fit really really nice i do really like it, it gives me a good shape it gives me a good shape um and i do really recommend this plus you know this because it's got like a curved hem at the bottom if you wanted to wear like a sweater vest over it or something you would be able to and it would just look beautiful you know so yeah, really, really happy with that. So I think that's the end of my haul. Yes, it is. That's the end of my haul, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please comment down below which pieces you like. I will try and find more pieces like the ones that you like in my next haul. So if you do like anything in particular, let me know in the uh, dis description. Let me know in the comments below. Please check out my last video. Thank you so much for your support on my previous videos, guys. You have been commenting and liking and subscribing. Thank you so, 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 so much. If you haven't subscribed and you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much. Please subscribe to my channel. Like 60% of my views come from people who aren't subscribed and only 40% from people who are. So thank you so much if you've watched, but please hit that big red subscribe button down below um, to be uh, kind of notified whenever I make a new Sheen haul or any sort of fashion haul. And... Um, have a great day or week and I'll see you in the next one.